Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we're here with another review. Today we're gonna have a look at these two collect uh, prehistoric trees or plants or whatever you wanna call them. I'm not very familiar with the species if I'm being honest. This one, the first one, this one is called Williamsonia. Hope I pronounced it right. And this one right here, which looks like some sort of palm trees, it's called Onathesia and Cicadedida. Hope I pronounce it right. First, let's have a closer look on the boxes. These are the behind part of the boxes. You can pause the video and have a closer and have a closer look for yourself if you want to read this text right here. And with this nice image, I didn't know that before I get this on my hand. You can actually use these trees and this some sort of a dinosaur basis to make this nice looking diorama. The Monathesia and Cicadedia code is 89403 as you can see right here and for the Williamsonia is 89400. So if you use this Coreaceratops family and the Hypsilophodon family you can have this nice looking diorama. Very nice cool you know figures. Here is also their actual names, in case I pronounced any of it right. So, these are basically, the reason I got them is basically because they look very cool on a dinosaur diorama, you know, if you want to have this nice, more natural looking, you know, diorama scene, definitely will add on yourself. So, let's waste no time and put them out of the box to see how they look. First, let's start with this one, the Williamsonia. And you can see on the underneath part of it, you can see the collector symbol. It says its name, which is something that I really appreciate on the collector brand. They always put the name of the figure on some part of it. To so you can actually know when you get on your hand what exactly is the item that you are holding. It says William Sonia, 2012, made in China. Collector. It's this nice cool looking tree. It's not that big of a tree if you see actually it's from the small trees of the collector brand it's very you know hard plastic but these leaves on the edges right here it's actually soft plastic but yeah the rest of the tree you know it's pretty stiff so let's start with the base you can see some leaves are falling down right here on the on the ground you can see some mud you know very nicely sculpted some smaller leaves, you know, some grasses right here actually on the ground and right here as well. So yeah, this is a smaller, I, I assume, Williamsonia and this is a bigger one. Probably this is some, some part of the tree that, the, you know, the, the dinosaurs used to eat. That's why it's orange, I assume. Like I said, I'm not very familiar with that, with that species. Yeah, very nice cool designed leaves right here, a lot of details, yeah, it looks pretty okay, you know, it is what it is for just a tree figure, nothing really, you know, that we need to say, but I would recommend you to pause the video and read this thing right here, it's very interesting infos, it's not about the trees, but general, they both say the same thing, in case you are interested. So, and let's have a closer look to the Monathesia and Cigadaidea trees. So, again, they come with this nice, cool looking base. It has this brownish, light brownish coloration for a sand, you know, mud or whatever it is. And again, you can see all these leaves on the ground. You can see some light brownish leaves and some other green is, which I'm th I assume this one is grass right here, but yeah, it is what it is. You can see also some grass flopping out right here on this area, and some other on this part right here, which is basically these two spots that I'm holding it from the grass, which is pretty cool. Yeah, this looks like a bulb of trees, you know, if I'm being honest. A prehistoric bubble tree, something among, the, among those lights. It reminds me of some coconuts, this right here. Very nicely painted, uh, I would say. Again, the, the base is very stiff. 
but yeah the leaves softer plastic you can actually see the difference but then probably these four trees down are different than the ones on the top that's called that's why it's called Monathesia and Sigadaidea I don't know which one of these is what but you get the point it's all the, it's all one on this one piece right here and of course underneath you can see the collector symbol Monathesia and Sigadaidea name of the plant 2012 made in China but yeah I think it's a very nice cool looking figure that we definitely will add a lot on yourself with dinosaurs here's a close a look next to the Papo T-Rex you can see the difference of these two but I think they will be pretty okay with a smaller dinosaur maybe they will look next, good next to the Papo Styracosaurus or the Papo Parasaurolophus as you can see as far as the scale goes they are pretty okay so let's take the Papo T-Rex from here these two would look really good you can actually place them somehow eating those, those plants you won't have any problem at all anyway so these were guys the collecta monathesi and cicadaida and willismonia prehistoric plants or trees figures thanks for watching the video i hope you enjoyed it and that i helped you out i'm gonna see you next time bye